Rescuers at a flooded cave in Thailand are desperately looking for ways to free a youth soccer team that is trapped inside before more heavy rain arrives. Twelve boys and a coach have been stuck in the cave for nearly two weeks. Up to five inches of rain are expected in the region over the next ten days. Some areas will get up to nine inches. Ben Tracy is outside the cave in Chiang Rai, Thailand. Ben, good morning. Good morning. So rescuers have been looking for an entrance to this cave from above, hoping that perhaps they could airlift the boys out. They are worried about the heavy rains that are headed this way this weekend, that they may flood the cave again and make any sort of rescue attempt nearly impossible. Emergency workers are racing to pump out the excess water from the flooded cave, trying to bring the levels down so it's safer to attempt to rescue the boys. They're drilling through rocks to make room for hoses, which have already helped remove more than 31 million gallons of water. Doctors are treating and feeding the young soccer players who are being given a crash course in swimming and how to wear dive masks in case they have to make the dangerous attempt to swim out of the dark and narrow cavern. It'd be terrifying, but the children who are aware of the cave, they know the cave, they've been in the cave very often, so... We just have to assess everything at the moment. Uh, we have to see what the conditions bring. Several sections of the cave remain flooded, including an area that requires full diving equipment. Rescue workers hope they can drain enough water to eliminate long stretches where the boys would have to keep their heads underwater. Tanawat is the father of the youngest boy trapped in the cave, an 11-year-old known as Titan. Are you worried about how they're going to try to get them out of the cave? He says, I believe the SEAL team can make it happen. There is nothing they can't do. I have faith. Tonawat says the Thai Navy SEALs have not told the families when or if they will attempt the dangerous rescue. And he knows it may be safer for his son to stay in the cave until the water recedes. Once your son finally comes home, what's the first thing you're going to say to him? I will tell him you are home and you are safe. Me and your mother were waiting for you, and we love you. Now, I did ask Titan's father if he blames the 25-year-old soccer coach who apparently went into the cave with these boys despite the signs of risk, and he says he does not. He says he's a good guy, and he gave all of his food and water to the boys until the rescuers arrived. Mm. Anthony? Ben Tracy in Thailand. Thanks. Yes, so many questions still about the, those boys could be down there for a long time. Yeah, so. we are rooting for those. Yes, boys. we all are. We are rooting for those boys.